everyone, it's Meg, and today I'm going to be doing my photo card collection update for July. Um, I did add a few things. I also added a few things that I missed last month when I was putting together my binders, and I did kind of rearrange, resort, and add um, a new binder. So yeah, let's just get started. So I had a different binder last time. I decided to get a bigger binder for my alts, the ones who I buy the most albums for consistently, as those will be the ones that I get the most photo cards for. Again, I don't collect photo cards. I don't have an, any intention of collecting photo cards um, regularly or collecting all the sets of photo cards. Uh, these are just my personal pulls and all the albums or DVDs or other things that I've bought for my favorite K-pop groups and artists. So yes, let's get started. So we will open this one up. And then in here is just something that did not fit. And that is Key's Hologram. I got a file folder pre-order gift for the deluxe edition of his Japanese album, which is really, really cute. And I did want to keep it in here so that way it would stay pristine. Okay, so for the main collection, we will start with BTS. So this is all the same, so there hasn't been any changes on this page here. And then no changes for Love Yourself series. And then no changes for Persona. And then here is where the first change. So this, I got the BTS World soundtrack and I pulled Jimin's double-sided card um, with this outfit and the chef outfit. And then for the game code card, I pulled Taehyung and the, the pajamas, it's so cute. It's honestly so cute. And I was so, so happy to pull them. So yes, really, really happy to add that to my collection. And as you can see, Jimin on this side is just most adorable ever. Um, these aren't photo cards, so I did buy um, BTS's Uno because I love playing board games and I'm a nerd, so buying K-pop related Uno cards just made me happy. Um, so not photo cards, but they were really cute, so I just decided to put one of the sets in here. Um, I like blue, so I put the blue versions of the cards in here. So these are those, and then these are the other Uno cards. And then here, I actually forgot to put my most beautiful moment in life um, photo cards in here last time. So I did pull Jungkook and Hobi, and then I put Taehyung's Arms Up School of Affair card here, and then Namjoon's Epilogue card here. And then there has been no change for Wings. And then here I rearranged and I put my Young Forever photo cards and my Persona postcards. And I did leave some room just in case they do have another postcard size thing for the next comeback. And then I have Army Bomb cards here, no change with that. And then um, Jungkook's uh, Seasons Greetings baby card. And then these are the live photos that came in the really big exhibition book. I do recommend um, purchasing it. It's really, really, really cute. So yes, I just wanted to look at them. So these are the live photos that came in that. And then this is the lenticular ticket from the BTS World soundtrack. And then this is the clear photo strip from Persona. And this is the same, the fourth muster postcard. And then here's my little tour section. Um, I didn't have a physical ticket for the Love Yourself World Tour when I went to Chicago last year. Um, but I did put my physical ticket for um, MetLife, <laughs> which went through a couple of different tickets because I started off in one seat and ended up in another. It's a whole, it's a whole story. Um, um, and then I put my QR codes for both shows and then the little confetti things that came down during the show that I was able to grab. So that is BTS. Some additions, some changes, and then some things that I forgot to put in last time. And then for Oh My Girl, a majority of it is still the same. So all of these are the same. And then these are the same. And then I did add my pulls from their second Japanese album. So I pulled Benny and Jiho from that. And they are just so cute. So I put that here. And then, of course, more room for their additional comebacks. And then I did add um, Yua and Hyojung's bookmarks from Closer Era. And the postcard that I pulled from their Japanese second album. And we get to shiny. So um, there are some additions, but other than those, this is still the same. These are the same. These are the same. Solos are still the same. I did pre-order Taemin's I'm Famous. I got the 
photo book version. I think it's a 60 page photo book, so super happy about that. I don't know if there's going to be a fan club version. Normally I just get one version, but I love photo books. As um, anyone who's seen any of my unboxings um, or hauls knows, I just I love buying the photo book versions of these things. So if the fan club version also has a big photo book, I may have to break my rule for Taman, which would not be surprising because it's Taman. Um, but no changes in the solo cards as of right now. And then this is still the same. And then here I have Minnow's Jackie from One of One. And I did decide to add Key's Christmas postcards from um, Hologram just because they're so cute. And this is from the limited edition, his Japanese album. The one that came with the CD, DVD, and these cute postcards. So I put those here. And then we get to Twice. So again, most of this is still the same. And these are the same. And again, these are just my pulls from albums and things. I don't collect, officially collect. Um, as you can see, JYP does give a lot. I must say I'm very, very happy about that. Um, fancy, all of that's still the same. I forgot I had the Twice Coaster Lane 1 pre-order set, so when I found it, I had to do some rearranging, which took a minute. Um, so I do have this pre-order set for Twice, Twice Coaster Lane 1, and then What is Love, Summer Nights, Yes or Yes, Year of Yes, and Fancy, and then this is still the same, the group cards. And then this is the same, and then no changes for twice postcards and the extras from last time. Those are all the same. And then Luna, so no changes in the postcards, but I did want to rearrange how I set everything up because I wanted to include the attendance booklet. So I have Hyojin, Hyunjin, um, Hustle, Yojin, and then Love and Live here. And then I have Vivi. Love and Evil, Kim Lip, Junsul, and Shetty here. And then I have Mix and Max, Mix and Match, Max and Match, um, Chetty, and then this blank spot that I don't know what to do with, but I wanted to keep this like this, so just kind of, I don't know, if I get an extra photo card around this era for some reason, I guess I could put it here. Um, and then I got two um, Eves and two Chews, so I got version A and B of Eve, and then version A of Chew and version B of Eve and Chew and their attendance booklets. And then Go On and Olivia, and then um, Normal Olivia from Y by Y Y, Limited Chew, and then Plus Plus. Limited, multiply, multiply, and then multiply, multiply, version A, and then version B, the unit versions for those. And then I decided to put Red Velvet in here because I'm finally caught up with all of their things for Korean releases. So I don't, I don't feel like as much pressure. I don't feel, I feel very relieved about that. So this is my Wendy page, <laughs> as you can see. Um, it is my Wendy page, but no. Um, no changes here. This is all still the same. But I did add my Reve Festival photo card. I did pull Irene and then I pulled Yeti's ticket and I'm really, really excited. Um, I got Yeti's version, of course, because she is my bias. But yes, really, really happy to have this. Um, depending on how long it takes for them to have another comeback, I may go after getting Cookie Jar and Sappy, the limited versions of those. Maybe. I haven't quite decided. Only because I did buy Idol's Japanese album and I did get Tamin's Japanese album and there's just a lot of stuff coming out. Um, but that is a goal. I do want to get Red Velvet's Japanese releases as well. But yes, that is all that is in here for this binder and I will get my next one. And then these are the other loves of my life. So this page is still the same with the exception of Chunga. So I did add the flourishing photo card and she is just so striking as a blonde. It is everything to me personally. Um, so yes, Chunga is here. And then this is still the same. And then I added the warranty card from um, 12 o'clock gotta go. And then I added the postcard from flourishing here. And then send me the full moon postcards are still the same. Um, I added the postcard from Sunmi's Gashino um, with the lyrics on the back. And then I also have Sunmi's Lenticular Bookmark from Morning. And then AT's is still the same. And then SNSD is still the same. EXID is still the same. 
I did make some changes here, so this is my little cube corner. <laughs> so here are all of Idol's normal uh, cards, and then I added CLC's member profiles from First Love and Refresh, and then these are the normal CLC and normal sized Hannah cards that I have. And then this is the same. This is the same. And then Pentagon, this is still the same. My Pentagon album actually just shipped, so I'm super, super excited to see who I pull. Really proud of them. Really hope they get their first win. They deserve it so much. Please, please, please vote for Pentagon. Support Pentagon. They absolutely deserve it. They are amazing. And yes, Jinho is the vocalist of our generation. Um, I can't remember if this is the same. I actually, I don't remember. Uh, I don't think this card was in here. So this is my little Pentagon 4-Minute section. Um, so this is the postcard bookmark photo card thing <laughs> from <laughs> Crazy. And then this is um, the big, big photo card I got from Hate. And then this is still the same from last time. And then this one is from Black Dress, and then this one is from Question for CLC, and then this one is still the same. And then Tomorrow by Together this is still the same, can't wait for a comeback. And then FX and Blackpink still the same, NCT Day 6 still the same, Stray Kids' this page is still the same. Um, I did make some additions to my Stray Kids collection because I did buy their newest album, Play to Yellow Wood. So I did add these three cards here. And then because I pre-ordered it, I did get the pre-order benefits, which was this big photo and this card of my bias Minnow, which I was so, so happy to pull him because he is my bias. So that just made me super happy. And then this page is still the same. This one is the same. And then this one, I decided to put my uh, photo card from April's the Ruby here, right next to my very first signed photo card of Yarim from Purple Beck, and I'm so, so happy to have it. Ugh, my first signed photo card. It is just so cute, so I was really, really happy to have this. I hope to collect more Purple Beck in the future. And then I do have these standees from Day 6's Shoot Me. I don't exactly know what to do with them, so they're just chilling in the back of here, just... Just casually, it's fine. So, yes, that is all of my updated collection as far as official things goes. Now, I have gotten a lot of freebies from stores and sellers and things like that when purchasing K-pop items. So I did decide that I wanted to put them all somewhere that wasn't, you know, in a bag cuz right now it was before this it was all in a bag and taking up a lot of space. So I decided to do a binder just for my freebies just to keep them cute and to remove them from <laughs> the big bag that could be used to store albums instead of storing these. So, again, these are all unofficial goods, just freebies that I've gotten over time. So, these are some BTS freebie cards. Um, NCT, Pentagon, Shiny, Girls' Generation, FX freebies, more FX, Girls' Generation. I got this um, sticker set for Heart Shaker from Twice, which is really cute. And then more Twice, Red Velvet, Tomorrow by Together, this cute um, BTS sticker. These BTS stickers, these BTS postcards, this postcard, <laughs> more BTS postcards more BTS postcards. As you can see, I order a lot of BTS things, so a lot of my freebies are BTS related. And then I have this double-sided bookmark of Yoongi and Taehyung, and then uh, more stickers and postcards. And then some BT21 stickers, which are really cute. And then I got this freebie, I do believe, from a Facebook um, group that I bought from. And then another BT21 freebie. And then Luna, shiny, him and shiny <laughs> and then more Luna idol and then I really like this freebie set even though it's just freebies and not official I just I love it um when I pre-ordered the album I actually got all of the freebies um for all of the girls so I just thought it was a cute little thing so I wanted to put them in here really really cute love Luna Stan Luna. Um, and then we have some twice here. Um, more red velvet. As you can see, you can tell what I buy by how many freebies I have. Um, there are some groups that I just don't ever get freebies for, even if I buy their album, which makes me really sad. But yes, I'm really happy to get freebies 
I love stickers and such. So got some red velvet stuff here, some NCTs, some ATs, and then some black pink, more NCT, more black pink, and stray kids. And then I have some bigger things that wouldn't fit. So I have this postcard of Itzy. Really excited for their comeback. I actually pre-ordered both versions. I told myself I did this because It's Different didn't get a physical release besides the promo. So yeah, I, I did that to myself. And then these bigger things that don't fit in here. So yeah, that is everything. All my freebies, all my official stuff, everything for the month of July. And really, really excited to keep collecting. I do have Ailey and Pentagon coming on the way. I've ordered things and I've already forgotten how much I've bought, which is really bad. Don't, don't ever do that. Don't ever just buy stuff and forget what you bought. Um, but yeah, really, really happy. Um, thanks to you guys so much for watching. Again, it makes me so happy to talk with you all and to share my love of K-pop and to share my love of collecting and to hear about the albums and groups and artists that you guys like. So Yes, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!